invitation from Carnation, the world's largest selling brand of evaporated milk, to hear the contented hour with our singing star, Buddy Clark. Tonight's special guests are those great Western singers, the Sons of the Pioneers. The Carnation Orchestra is directed by our brilliant arranger conductor, Ted Dale, and I'm Jimmy Wally. <laughs> And here's Buddy Clark. The morning I did see blossoms on the apple tree. I took a breath and thought, could it be the screen of time? Then I began to look around, and in every field I found, greens were pushing up to the ground for green of time. Then sure enough, the bluebells tinkled April in the glen And sure enough I fell in love with love again then I started feeling awful bright Had a thought that hit me right I'll have my honey dance me tonight And have a time And welcome in the greed of time And sure enough the bluebells tinkled, April in the glen, and sure enough, I fell in love with love again then. I started feeling awful bright, had a thought that hit me right. I'll have my honey dance me tonight, and have a time, and welcome in the green of time. Let's raise the dim to welcome in the green of Thank you. It sounds as though you like that. Well, I do, too. It's a little song called Green Up Time from the brand new musical, Love Life, which just opened on Broadway. May very well turn out to be a hit. Of course, it's hard to predict hit songs, but it's easy to sing them, especially when they like this next one. Don't blame me. <laughs> Why 
One of America's great comedians is Bob Burns. And for many years, he's been known as a leading Arkansas, or well, le- leading citizen, I should say, of Arkansas. Well, Bob's radio theme is a fine American folk song which Ted Dale has worked into a new setting for the Carnation Orchestra. Let's listen to the Arkansas Traveler. <laughs> Halloween pumpkin picked out yet, buddy? No, Jimmy, I think I've finally outgrown the Halloween stage. How about you? Oh, no jack-o'-lanterns for me either. You know, I, I'll take my pumpkin in pie made with carnation milk. I'm a real pumpkin pie fan from way back. And you can take it from me, pumpkin pie made with carnation evaporated milk is just about the best pie in the whole world. And here's something you ladies will appreciate. It's very economical, too. You can actually cut down the number of eggs in the filling when you use carnation milk. That heavy, velvet-smooth texture of carnation is the secret. It makes your pumpkin pie filling taste much richer, too. Carnation evaporated milk keeps the cost down in so many good recipes. And, Mother, here's an idea for your Halloween party. Whip up enough filling to make little individual pumpkin pies. The children will be crazy about it. So remember, tomorrow, get a few cans of carnation evaporated milk and help yourself with carnation whenever the recipe calls for milk. Carnation makes coffee taste better, too. Yes, you'll like coffee and carnation. Just try it. Our guests tonight are a stalwart group of six upstanding Westerners who really wrote the book when it comes to singing the songs of the great outdoors. Here they are, 
Bob Nolan, and the Sons of the Pioneers. Well, thank you, folks. That's mighty friendly. Glad to see you boys again. I hear you've been away. Sure have, buddy. Been down east on the road for about four months. Well, I don't suppose you got as far east as my hometown of Boston. Well, we came close. We played uh, Reed's Ferry in New Hampshire. Reed's Ferry? Well, that's practically next door to Boston. I'm sure they made you feel right at home. Oh, they treated us fine, buddy. In fact, all those easterners were just like westerners. Well, did you play the theaters? Well, we played 65 of them. And uh, a number of the outdoor parks. We had audiences in some places that numbered oh, over 25,000 people. Say, that's great. But right now, we have a crowd of millions waiting to hear you. Well, okay, buddy. We won't keep them waiting. Here's a song that seems to uh, please a lot of folks. A Cowboy Has to Sing. When he's new day is born, I go riding in the air. On the wide open plains I roam. In the air. Till the sun through the hills goes hiding in the air. about an orchestra number coming up right now. We're very proud of our pianist, George Greeley, and of course, we're proud of Ted Dale. Maybe some of you didn't know that Ted is no mean piano man himself. Here's a special treatment of Jerome Kern's She Didn't Say Yes, featuring two pianos, played by George Greeley and Ted Dale. <laughs> 